it is more relevant to assume that uh, every emotion has a story than to prove that uh, every story has an emotion attached to it. You know what? I am never going to understand what kind of statuses she posts on Facebook and why and how they pop up in her mind. But I know one thing, that she is a hell of an awesome friend to be with. She might be into this major thoughts kind of shit, but she knows very well how to be a crazy animal while being with someone like me. Since you became colleagues, now we have talked to each other much. But uh, from what I know about her, I have found one commonality between us, and that is a love for God. She is a nice girl. A girl being free and dead kilometers away from her house, works, studies and still talks. Just imagine how interesting, intelligent, beautiful, powerful, strong girl she would be. I know sometimes I exaggerate a lot, but seriously, she's awesome. I just love her. Don't take a little mini out of that, but uh, you want to take a little mini out of that, go for the next time. in front of you is not going to utter a single word. That's why I have to be here and I am going to play Sharman Joshi of Golman for next few moments. Because he has to blush, because he has to talk about Preksha and because he has fallen for her and because he knows that she also loves him. I didn't know it was her birthday. 
maybe because she is not there in uh, friend list on my Facebook, I guess. And uh, anyways, she is not some friend whose birthday I would like to remember. Next, sir, do the chingam girl who stretches every matter to the best possible length. Ah, this is crazy. Why would I want to wish some random stranger on a birthday?